away from speed and the need for hurry to the peace of the sea's patient pulse, to a coastal road in Scotland where air means the scent of heather and the place where Burns was born. A step or two and you reach Kirkuswald, where Souter Johnny and Tam O'Shanter still enchant, as they enchanted their country's poet. Souter, or shoemaker Johnny, was John Davidson. Tam came from nearby Shanter Farm. Together they had drunk with Kirkton Jean and the landlord of the local inn, while Burns had weaved their lives into one of his finest works, giving them immortality. And at Tam's elbow, Souter Johnny, his ancient trusty Druthy Crony, Tam loved him like a very brother. They had been fool for weeks together. The suitor told his queerest stories. The landlord's laugh was ready chorus. Here in a tiny room, Robbie Burns was educated. Barely a nook in Kirkus World is without the imprint of his fame. Everything relating to his life is lovingly cared for. The spinning wheel that belonged to the suitor's wife. And suitor Johnny's very tools. There's many a toast to Burns at the Tamashanta Inn, and there's many a grateful tear where inspiration lies buried. Go to your marble graves, ye great, in all the tinkler trash of state, but by the honest turf I'll wait, thou man of worth.